Hello everybody, 4 Star here and we are back with another Madden 2004 Jets franchise mode here and if you have gotten this far with us, we are at Super Bowl 39 against the Buccaneers here. The Buccaneers somehow, someway getting past the wild card, getting past the divisional and finally winning in the, a in the NFC Championship game in an upset win against the St. Louis Rams who had them down by 20 points by halftime but somehow some way their defense clawed them back into winning that game. If you guys did not watch uh watch the AFC and NFC championship videos, please watch that. It was a it was two great games here, especially the Buccaneers game which I uh spectated. It was absolutely crazy. But let's get right into the roster here with the Buccaneers. All right, guys, so taking a look at the rosters here, man, this defense is stacked. This is by far the best defense we have come across all season. Derrick Brooks, Warren Sapp, uh, Simeon Rice, questionable, but I think he's, I think he's going to come in. Martin Gramatica, one of the best kickers in the game. Rondé Barber, we just saw him get a pick six. John Lynch, he was he was shut down. They even got Mike Allstock, Keyshawn Johnson, uh, Anthony McFarland, big booger. Damian Woody is the center. Just, just a crazy team here. And all of them, 90 overalls or better. And then you got Brian Kelly, who just got six picks. No, not six picks. I'm sorry. Three picks in the, the last game in the, uh, in the NFC Championship game. And we are uh, facing an uphill battle here. Um, now, their starting quarterback has been Jared Lorenzen. He got benched for Brad Johnson. But I think he's going to be starting here today. Um, along with Quincy Wilson, Michael Pittman is probable, so they should be starting with him. But uh, they may, they might go for Quincy Williams for Quincy Wilson for the first a uh, few drives here. But yeah, man, just a, a solid team, even a solid wide receiver core, I would say. So Keyshawn Johnson still doing his thing. Kenny McCardell, Ernest Wilford, we saw get two touchdowns in the NFC Championship game here. So it should be an exciting one. So let's skip right on to it. Let's go to it, man. Super Bowl 39 against the Buccaneers. Let's go. All righty, guys. We are here season two. It only took us two seasons to get here. But now we have to finish the job here. Super Bowl 39 here. Welcome, guys, to Jacksonville, Florida. And it's a frigid 39 degrees. I know that is cold for Jacksonville. I live up here in Jersey. And 39 degrees going down to Jacksonville, that sounds horrible, but Super Bowl 39, 39 degrees. How ironic is that? Of course, they're highlighting Brad Johnson and uh, Jared Lorenzen here, uh, mainly Jared Lorenzen, but he had a horrible performance last week. As you know, he's uh, through three interceptions with no touchdowns. So we definitely have to take advantage of that. And of course, they're going to highlight Keyshawn Johnson. As we didn't start our starters until the very end here, but Chad Pennington says he is ready to go. So get ready for that here. As Jared Lorenzen is gonna dot us up with Keyshawn Johnson on like the the second play of the drive, the second play of the game here. But here comes Jared Lorenzen once again, giving it to his rookie Wilford. He gets a nice little first down near. First and 10 here, and they're going to give it to Quincy Wilson. Quincy Wilson with a nice spin move. He's going to move off to the left hash and take it into the end zone for the Super Bowl's first touchdown of the day. And what a start here to that drive here by Tampa Bay, making it look easy here as Quincy Wilson just goes down the field for a touchdown. But Santana Moss wants to make his mark in this Super Bowl too as he gets all the way down to uh, the opponent's 30-yard line here, making it a short field drive here for the Jets offense here. And that will be a first down here from Curtis Martin. Pennington going to throw a dot right to Wayne Corbett. I'm sorry, Anthony Beck there for a first and goal. And here on first and goal, we're going to give it to our goal line merchant this series. Curtis, my favorite, Martin, going into the end zone for a nice touchdown there. And, man, is it glad? am I glad to have uh, Chad Pennington back here. Of course, Chad Pennington was injured, tore his pack, but, miracul but miraculously... We have one of the best doctors in the business, man. And uh, we got him back by the time of the Super Bowl. He was questionable. And he only dipped down to a 93 overall. We could definitely take it here as Jared Lorenzo once again dotting up Donnie Abraham here uh, and getting Keyshawn Johnson on those wide open looks here. But we almost get a nice little pick there by Victor Hobson. 
It comes Lorenzen once again. He's going to give it to Allstock. He's going to take it inside the 20 yard line. That's one of his go to receivers here. Uh, definitely an underrated receiver for this team is Mike Allstock. They're going to give it to Quincy Wilson once again here, making it a third down and two. And Wilson just going to go on the outside here. And he might get another touchdown there, but Ellis just stops him just short of that touchdown here. Going to give it to Allstock here, and he immediately dies. Doesn't even get an inch. Lorenzo going to give it to Wilson again, but Wilson just making it past Beasley tackle, and he's going to take it into the end zone for his second touchdown of the day. And he's looking for that Super Bowl MVP, but let's hope that we don't give him the opportunity here as a nice little dot there, a bullet right to Braylon Edwards for the first down here, and another bullet right to Anthony Beck. And Anthony Beck says, get out of my way, son. I'm here to get a ring for New York here as he gets a nice first down past midfield. Pennington going to get hit there. I don't even know the uh, who, who that was. I know that was 43, but what a tackle there and a fumble, but it makes it a third and immeasurably long here. Third and 25 here. We'll give it to Conway, and he gets just a few there as we punt the ball away. We put them deep in their own territory here, and Wilson trying to get a run there, but look at Corey Webster, man, the blitzing king here, and he gets a nice little TFL there. Second down 14 here in danger of getting a safety here. But Jerry Lorenzen just barely gets it off there to Wolford, and he makes it a third and manageable. Third down and manageable here, and they go with another toss play there from Wilson, but Robertson is there for the tackle. But good job doing the first down there by Tampa Bay. Second down and 10 here, and what a floater to Johnson, but Sam Garns is there, and I'm so glad to have Sam Garns back as I start in uh, strong safety. And as Wilford gets another big first down there, that will, that will uh, take them past midfield here on a second and six. We're going to give it to Wilson once again. And there goes Victor Hobson, our second-year man, going to get the nice little first down save and tackle. Third down and two here for Wilson, but it looks like uh, John Abraham is there for the TFL. And what a time for our defense to step up, guys. Our defense has been lackluster at the very least, at the very best. Um, but we have uh, prevailed through that with our passing game. And look at those floaters by Chad Pennington, that peck. Must be working immaculately, man. We give it to BJ Askew. Get your fullbacks involved here. A quote from the great Coach Dawkins here on YouTube. Gets us a first down there. We're going to keep feeding the ball to Curtis Martin, right? We got him all the way down here to the Super Bowl. We might as well feed him the ball. 1,500 rushing yards. Why not? As we give it to our slant merchant, Braylon Edwards, for the nice first down. Second down and 10 here for Pennington. And he's going to try to get it to Edwards on a slant again, but they know the plays. Third down and 10 here. We're going to give it to Santana Moss. And what a broken tackle day. Breaks Kelly just to pass that yellow imaginary line for the first down here. But Pennington is going to meet up with Rudd here for the big sack. Second down and long here. Almost getting sacked again there by Booger McFarlane, but we're just going to throw the ball away there and save ourselves uh, an, a, another injury here. But Pennington going to throw this to wide open Curtis Conway here, who has been contemplating retirement since he's been bumped down, but he gets a Super Bowl touchdown here. Who would have thought uh, Conway would find himself in this, uh, in this predicament here as uh, Tampa Bay is going to try to Go down the field here, but looking like turnstiles out here. Our defense just not stopping anything. Second down in inches here. Lorenzen, once again, getting pressured there, but he's going to find Keyshawn here, and he gets him into field goal range. So they're just going to pull out Grammatica. Kick is up, and the kick is good for one of the best kickers in the game here. And we're going to go into halftime just down by three here from a beautiful Buccaneers drive here to end the half. So an impressive first half here by our offense. We cannot complain, but we got to get our picks out the way. Derrick Brooks with a leaping pick there. And Derrick Brooks says, welcome back, Chad Pennington from that torn pack. I'm going to have to get you on that one. But Wilford going to get this nice curl route. And the curl route is so demonic in this game. It just works so well here. And they get a touchdown here. Now we're down by 10. But here comes Wayne Corbett. First down merchant. Going to get another first down for us here. Second and eight here. We're going to feed it to Curtis Martin. Curtis Martin breaks free, gets a nice little juke there, and he will get the first down. Passing midfield here, first and 10 for Pennington. 
penitent looking throws it right to Wayne Corbett another first down merchant first down from our guy here comes penitent once again gonna give it to Anthony Beck and Anthony Beck gonna take us near the goal line there is it gonna be first and ten at the 11 penitent once again finds Santana Moss and he will get his first touchdown of the day Santana the man of the wide receiver of the year award winner He's going to get a touchdown here in the biggest stage of them all here. Drop pass there by all stock there. So it's going to make it a second and 10. Wilson going to get some moves there. And he's going to get about a three-yard gain there to make it a third down and seven. Lorenzen dropping back here. Comfortable pocket here. But he's going to get slapped away. Get that thing out of here. That's Sam Garns. And that was our, I believe that was our first three and out in a while here. The great job there by our defense at the biggest of spotlights here. But look at Santana Moss. Like I told you guys, that curl route is demonic, and he just uses his blazing speed to outrun the defenders as he gets his second receiving touchdown of the day. The Yak Demon is Chad Pennington, the Santana Moss merchant. I mean, hey, I don't know. But guess what? We are in the lead somehow after being down by 10. Two unanswered touchdowns here. And Beasley getting a nice little Beasley chant. We haven't heard that one from a while. And he will get that tackle. But here comes Joe Jeravicious getting a nice catch and first down here. First and 10 here for Lorenzen. Lorenzen looking, but guess who he found? He found Aaron Beasley. And he's going to take it all the way back into the end zone for about a 30-yard INT return for a touchdown. And now guess what? We were down by 10, but now we are up by 11 with three. Three unanswered touchdowns here in the Super Bowl. Unbelievable job by our defense here. I swear I did not touch these sliders since season one. I believe like week like seven. I have not touched these sliders here. We are just going hard against uh, Jared Lorenzen here as they get a first down here. But the score has changed drastically. But guess who just got him on the same exact route? You are not going back in the video. This is the same play again, and Aaron Beasley makes some pay. His second INT return for a touchdown, and if that's not a lock for Super Bowl MVP, I don't know what is. That was an amazing play here. Now we're up 42 to 24. We got the numbers swapped here, and they're trying to make a comeback. Here comes Lorenzen. Not scared here, but he has to be scared as number 92 is coming for you. That is going to be Sean Ellis with another sack. But here comes Collins. Collins just barely not going to get that first down here. It's going to be fourth down. They punt the ball away here to start off the fourth quarter. But here comes Pennington. He's going to try to make a throw incomplete. Second down and 10 here. We're going to go with the run on the left side to Martin. He's going to get sacked down there by Kelly. Third down and seven here. Pennington throws a slant route to Santana Moss, but it's going to get tipped away. So we punt the ball back after a three and out. So here comes Lorenzen, a floater, and all stock can't hold on to it, man. That was easy to catch. So here comes Lorenzen, pump fakes, throws it, but he gets hit hard there by guess who? John Abraham. And they would punt the ball again back to us here. And this is an interesting call. This is the Super Bowl, baby. You got to go for it here. It's only one game left here. And when you got a guy like Curtis Martin who could break free to get a first down, I don't know what to tell you. They're just giving the game away for us. But here, look at Curtis Martin. I don't even got to say enough. I don't even got to say, I don't even got to say too much. Look at this man as he gets two broken tackles to pass that imaginary yellow line for the first down. And there is Lamont Jordan. He gets a nice little cameo appearance. 39 here. Pennington feeling the pressure there. But look at John Lynch. Shout out John Lynch here. Got his 49ers to the divisional game here as a GM. But nice little tip away there. But we end up with three points here. And now it is a 21-point game here in Jacksonville. And here comes Keyshawn Johnson. Breaks a tackle here. Breaks another tackle. There. And you're going to tackle him five yards from Robinson's face mask. An impressive play there. Uh, still a 24 to 45 game here with five minutes in the fourth here. Cleveland, who got the game winning touchdown last week, is going to get the first down at this time. Wilson going to get a nice catch there. And now you can see they're matriculating down the field, but the time is ticking. Tick, 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 tick here. And here comes Collins here, the rookie wide receiver, getting a nice little first down here. But now we are creeping. To that three minute mark here and here comes wilson getting a nice little first down there and man let me tell you something sam garns 
he's about that action, man. He's taking hits. And there goes a nice little first down there from Keyshawn Johnson. Now it's a first and goal. And guess what? If this was if this was a winning game for the Buccaneers, Wilson's getting an MVP. That's his third rushing touchdown of the day here. They go with the onside kick here. Nobody can catch the ball, but it floats out of bounds here and it's not looking good for Tampa Bay. They need to stop here. 14 point game here. We're going to just give it to Curtis Martin. Why not here? Warren Sapp gets the tackle. Third down and four here. We tried to get him off here with the play action here. We did have BJ ask you, but number 31 was not playing games with us. And so they still have a shot here. Here comes Lorenzen. Throws it down the field. No go. It's going to be a third down this time. Crucial third down here. Lorenzen, once again, looking. Throws it, but it's going to get tipped away by guess who? The MVP of the game, Aaron Beasley. Lorenzen, fourth down. And Robinson is right there for us here. And now we are matriculated all the way down to the one yard line. Curtis Martin, we're going to feed him the ball to get a nice little 50 burger. Our first 50 burger, uh, mind you, in this series in the Super Bowl. So we get 51 points here. We get 52 points with the extra point. And we win this one by 21 against the Buccaneers. And we have won the Super Bowl, folks. Super Bowl 39 champions here. And as you can see, the MVP always holds the trophy. Aaron Beasley wins MVP here with two INT returns for touchdowns. And look at our soldier. Chad Pennington was questionable here, but I put him in the game. 93 overall. He had 70. He, I believe he had 76 injury. That was still good enough for me. Curtis Martin with two touchdowns. Santana Moss with two touchdowns. Curtis Conway with a touchdown. And what a way to encapsulate our offense this season. Of course, all the heavy hitters getting touchdowns, including our defense here. Corey Webster had a great day. Sean Ellis with a sack. Aaron Beasley with two INTs returns for touchdowns to win Super Bowl MVP. This is why he is staying on the team forever, guys. But that is it for season two, guys. We win this one. Of convincingly 52 to 31 a 21 point blowout here in the Super Bowl here and it was amazing thank you guys so much for sticking with me this series but the series is not over with yet I still want to see how we fare in this all Madden mode I feel like we haven't really seen the true potential and of course we have to work on this defense this defense is not yet finished here so I'm gonna post I, I, the Pro Bowl video did uh, did numbers for my channel, so I'm going to do another Pro Bowl video, and then we're going to go right into the off season here. Of course, we're going to do the same thing again. Thank you guys so much for watching, and hopefully you stick with me in this series because I feel like it's going to get a lot more interesting. Make sure you guys like and subscribe, and we'll see you guys on the next video.